morning, Bumblebeezies. Happy Tuesday. It is 8.30 right now. My hair is wet, but I was so hot this morning because we were like cleaning up and stuff and unpacking more things. So I tied it back. Anyways, I made myself some breakfast. I have some avocado toast. <gasps> Look at that. It looks so good. This is keto bread. I put a little bit of butter on my bread. Why did I say it like that? Like butter. I put a little bit of butter and then avocado I seasoned with a little bit of Himalayan salt garlic powder and then I have scrambled eggs and then I added everything bagel seasoning I want some hot sauce I'm gonna add some El Yucateco just a little bit That's really good. Oh my gosh, you guys. Okay, it's wet right now because it was in the sink, but I bought this avocado tool. You guys, I know like you don't need this, but this is like the best thing ever. You use this like to cut the avocado. Cav cut the avocado open and then the center to remove the pit and then this part slices the avocado out it's like the best thing ever i'm telling you i got it at target i'm, I'm sure they have it like everywhere but. Ooh, hot. oh my gosh you guys it's so spicy my mouth is on fire okay Today I'm just going to have the Starbucks iced coffee. There's a little bit left, so we're going to finish that. And then today's tumbler. I got this new tumbler when we went to downtown Disney. It's Starbucks Disneyland. It's so cute. I actually already have one of these, but it's the old design. God, my lips are on fire. Perfect. And then I picked up this creamer yesterday at Stater Brothers. It's the sugar-free caramel macchiato, the international delight. God, what the heck is happening? I can't, I think I've tried this before and I can't remember if I like it or not. So let's give it a try. guys I don't like it I don't like it <laughs> I don't like this new creamer I think I tried it before but I couldn't remember so that's why I got it again okay anyways I want to find a bar slash like buffet table for the corner over there um I haven't really found one that I like. I also still need to find a TV stand. I can't pick, I can't decide you guys. <laughs> I have been looking at so many websites, so many different TV stands, so many different coffee tables. We also need a coffee table and I just can't, I don't know, I just can't decide on one. I'm not in a rush though. Um, I think the TV stand is a little more important. Well, actually not even because we can just mount the TV. Anyways, I'm just, rambling i have to go back to work i hope everyone has a good tuesday i'll talk to you guys later don't forget stay positive and be productive get it so these boxes over here these are the what is it vanessa's desk or her vanity and then my nightstands from ikea i just need to build them but i'm gonna wait until we get our furniture um and then i will build these and put them upstairs we need to go back to target and get another frame for this puzzle this puzzle we actually just had it in another frame like we had two pictures or two puzzles in one frame um i can't even lift this up what the heck and then we reframed these puzzles into smaller lightweight frames these are just like you know like lightweight like wood wooden frames because before they were glass so we reframed these, that way I can hang them up on the walls using command strips because I don't want to use nails. So we're going to find a place for these frames. I'm thinking like one over here and then one over here 
And then I need to get like different artwork for these places or maybe one puzzle here and one puzzle here. I don't know yet, but we'll see what's, what's going on. Nothing. What the heck? What is in this box? DVDs? Yeah. This box is DVDs, so once I nail the... I'm going to attach the bookshelf to the wall, then I'll have the kids put the DVDs up. We just finally opened up our trash can. You can see here a lot of the boxes are gone. We did a lot. We did get a lot of unpacking done. There's just a few things left. And then all this here, I think this is just yeah, games. What else? More kitchen stuff in that box. This is like the video games that go with the TV. So once we get the TV stand, we can put that there. Um, the bar is going to go here. And there's just like some random things that I need to put away. But this is what it's looking like. This is what it's looking like right now. It's still looking like a mess, but what can you do? We're still unpacking. Oh, and then in the bathroom. In the bathroom, I hung up the Little Mermaid poster. This used to be in the kids' bathroom at the old house. This used to be in their bathroom. Um, but since there's not really any like wall space in their bathroom, I just put it in here. I think it looks really good. What do you guys think? Let me know. Pantry, you guys. We unloaded, unloaded. We unpacked all of our pantry boxes and oh my gosh, you guys. We have so much stuff. And I'm gonna use some of the organizing bins that you guys sent me. Um, I just need to unpack and I need to open them up and then fix it, you know, like organize this because it's kind of, well, we have a lot of stuff and it's a very small pantry, but look at these, you guys. I think my friend Donna got these for me. These are perfect for our small snacks and I love that they're stackable. My keto cups, they fit so perfectly in here. These are Rice Krispie treats and then the kids have just like random other snacks in here. So this is perfect. It is a huge space saver. I love these so much. Um, yeah, I have more of those. I think there's two, two more of those. So those are perfect. I love them so much. I just need to open up the other organizing bins and then try to, you know, organize a little bit better. But this is what it's looking like. Also, I got these new rice, dis not rice dispenser, rice containers. I didn't bring my rice dispenser with me. I wanted to get something smaller, something that was more airtight. So I actually got two of these. Each one can hold 30 pounds of rice. I normally buy 50 pound bags of rice at a time. So I just split it between these two. And then it's just, there's wheels on the back so you can pull it forward. And then it also came with the measuring cup. I have so many of these, but you know, it came with it and you can just measure your rice that way. And it's airtight, I love it. I might put one in the garage just to make more room in here, but for now I have them both in here. And then I have just some other stuff down there. So yeah, that's what it's looking like right now. It's lunchtime. I'm just gonna have a salad for lunch, just a very simple salad. So I have this garden salad mix. I bought this yesterday at the grocery store. I keep it in this produce container. Oh my gosh, I love this so much. This is the large, the largest container. And then it's cool because it actually has like a guide up here to tell you if it needs water or venting. It has a vent here on the side to allow like some air inside. So yeah, that's it. And then I just have it in here. I'm gonna add a little bit of Caesar dressing. Normally I like to um, get the romaine, but they didn't have it, so this is fine. I just got off of work. Well, no, I didn't just get off of work. Why do I always say that? Well, we, we, you just got off work and then we <laughs> It's have. like, yeah, it's like five o'clock right now. Um, we're, we are, we're in Redlands. We're gonna go to Famous Footwear. And then I also need to go to Target to return something. And then after Target, I don't know, but there's a lot of stores here. I really like it here. And I there's also a crumble cookie that just opened. So we might go there. And I know AJ wants to go to GameStop. So we'll see. Let's go to Famous Footwear. Oh, I think I also want to go to DSW because there's one just down down the way. I love this. Vanessa likes these platform Doc yeah, Martens. <laughs> AJ doesn't like them. I like them. You have to like have the right style for it. You got to yeah. put the right outfit together for it. Yeah. It'll be really cute. We are at Crumble Cookies. The kids wanted to come because they this week they have the cookies with candy on it. We're back home. 
I'll show you guys the cookies that we got. Oh no, is it melted? Oh, here we go. Ooh, look at that, it looks so good. Okay, so this one is Heath Cake, or you know, Heath Bar, chocolate chip, M&M, and Kit Kat. Oh my gosh, they look good. Yes. Are you excited to try them? Yeah. Okay, so anyways, it is seven o'clock. I am gonna start on dinner. This is the meat that I bought at Stater Brothers. It's marinated carne asada. So I'm warming up my grill pan right now, and then I'm just gonna grill the meat there. Oh my goodness, you guys, look at that meat. So good, I cut a small piece off just to try it and it's so good, I love it. So I'm gonna cut that up into small pieces and then I already cut up the cilantro and the onions. Ooh, the lighting looks kind of weird, but yeah, onions, cilantro, the meat, and then tortillas, I'm gonna warm these up. Kids will have the small, the street tacos, the corn tortillas. I'm gonna use one of these, the low carb tortillas. Dinner was so good. What did you guys think of that carne asada? Um, 10 out of 10. 10, out of 10. What did you get? So good. Okay, yeah. now we have a couple of gifts to open from our housewarming registry. Which one are you opening first? This Target? This one. This, this one? one? Okay. Is that from Target too? Uh, I'm not sure. Target, yeah. Any guesses? Any guesses? I think it's placemats. Yeah. From Ate Ariel's mom. Yeah. Cause I did check the registry this t today, so I saw like who got me what. No, there's no. There's no no, but I think this is from Ate Ariel's mom. Thank you. You're welcome. Oh yeah, I didn't even show it. These are so nice. So, so now we have two sets of placemats. We have because we can change the color. We have no. <laughs> we have this one and the gray, the gray ones. This is so fun. Ninja Blender. There's actually a note on the side of this box and Yarny. it says, Hi Melissa, congratulations on your new home. I have been watching you for a year and my kids tell me, tell me you are my identical twin. And then I don't know who it's from, the name is cut off, but I can, I'll check the, um, my registry. It's a ninja, oh my gosh. Where are you gonna put it? Thank gonna you, it you can make your smoothies. Thank you so much for the smoothies. blender. Are you excited Thank for smoothies? Yes. We can buy that thing that we saw at Costco, the fruit. It's already sectioned. Alfredo, he gets that one too. Thank you guys. Thank you. Thank you. Good morning, Bumblebeezies. Happy Wednesday. Happy hump day. It is 7.48 right now. You guys, my allergies. <laughs> um. I just got off of the bike, well, maybe like 20 minutes ago, and I'm actually boiling some eggs in the air fryer. I've, this is my first time boiling eggs in the air fryer, so hopefully they turn out. Because <laughs> I looked it up, like how to do it, and there's so many different, you know, people, some people cook it at 275, some at 300, so, and then there's, you know, depends on how cooked you want it, so I put it in at 280, because mine didn't, go to 275 I think it's at 280 uh, for 11 minutes so we'll see because um, I kind of want it like not not really like a soft boil but not all the way hard boiled like a, somewhere in between that anyways I'm gonna make myself um, an Americano so I have my espresso beans right here I am going to grind them first I have my grinder over here on the side I put three scoops. Okay. Okay, so I have this. I have my little mug down there. Oh, I forgot to turn it on. We have to turn it on first. So once the, um, you turn it on and then once it's ready to go, the light will stop flashing. And then we're gonna do two shots. So we'll just turn it to two.
So here's my espresso. I'm going to add some um, water to this and then I'll show you guys what I do after that. So here's my iced Americano. It's just ice, water, and then I added a little bit of creamer. I didn't measure, but I did about probably like two tablespoons. Um, you can sweeten it with just like sweeten like syrup. You can sweeten it with syrup. You can add some heavy whipping cream. You can add cream. Like you can add whatever you want. But yeah, it's so good. I love it. You guys, the eggs came out perfectly, just like exactly how I wanted them. Oh my gosh, you guys, look, they look so good. I think this is like the perfect way to cook your eggs, especially if you wanna use it in your soup, like your ramen. Oh my gosh, you guys. So after I took them out of the air fryer, I immediately put them into an ice bath and I just let it sit there while I was making my coffee. And yeah, they peeled very easily and yeah, they're so perfect. I'm gonna start unpacking the rest of the kitchen boxes. These are, all i think they're all like plates and um what else do i have in here like vases and stuff and pictures talk to me nice talk to me honestly look in my eyes don't let it fall on tacos well not leftover tacos but we're having tacos again we had a little bit of meat leftover and then we had this one that i didn't cook yesterday because i already knew it was going to be too much so i cooked that one today i we have the leftovers we have onion and cilantro i'm going to cut this up and then uh, warm up the tortillas and prepare the tacos i just got off of work we are at barnes and noble the kids just wanted to i don't know Look around. Oh wow, there's Starbucks area. The cafe is so big. Does anybody want a Starbucks? It's kind of late. <laughs> We're not going to sleep tonight. Look at this, you guys. They have a hashtag book talk. And then look at this. The unofficial TikTok cookbook. Oh, there's a whole section for Legos. Oh yeah. It says building. We're back home. Yesterday we didn't have time to go to DSW, so we went to DSW. Then we also went to Skechers. Vanessa did buy a pair of shoes at DSW, but um, she said she already put them away, so she doesn't want to show you guys. <laughs> no, you don't have to show them. It's okay. It's all the way upstairs, but it's like a pair of cute little boots, booties, yeah. ankle height boots. Yeah, yeah, they're super cute. Anyways, um, at Ske I went. To, we went to Skechers and I found these. I was on the hunt for something like this, like a sandal, but like a walking sandal. And I found these at Skechers. They're so comfortable. They're called the Arch Fit. 
Podiatra Certified Arch Support. So you can see it's got like a thicker sole with arch support here. They're very soft, cushiony, like they're super cushiony. And then this, this strap, like this whole unit is adjustable, very comfortable. I'm gonna test these out at Disneyland this Sunday. So hopefully they're comfortable because I really wanna wear them to Disney. And these were $65, they were not on sale, but they're so, well, I think they're cute. What do you guys think? So I'm gonna try these out at Disney. I'll let you guys know if they're comfortable for like all day walking. Yesterday, I actually got a pair of Nikes that are similar to this at Famous Footwear, um, but I ended up returning them because there's like a thick strap right here. It was too tight on my foot. Um, so I ended up returning them, but they're really cute and comfortable. I think just because my feet are fat <laughs> But if you have like a, a thinner foot more not narrow necessarily, but just like not as fat <laughs> They would fit you more better than me. They would fit you better than me But um, they're called the Nike Oasis. So if you want to look them up, they're really cute But yeah, I got these ones instead um, So I just found this really scary lump it's quite big. I'm just really trying to go to sleep. And this is really scaring me. Um, so I guess I'm just gonna... Oh, it's moving. Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god. Oh my god, it's moving. I think this is some sort of egg. Some sort of creature. Some sort of alien creature egg. Oh, it's opening it up. Oh my god, there's a hand. Oh, okay. It's closed. Oh wait, it's opening, it's opening, it's opening. Oh, hi. Oh my god. It's just you. What are you doing? Calling me lamp. What? What are you doing? Calling me a lump. lamp. Lamp. Lump. 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 Because it looked like a big lump. Oh, it's just me. Don't be scared. You sleep next to me? I'll pass on this one. Oh. I want to say thank you to my fans. You guys really love me. I'm truly grateful. Yep. Shout out to all the Steuven stands. Steuven lovers. Steuven lovers. Leave a monkey emoji if you love me. What if they don't love you? What if they're a Steuven hater? What can they leave? Then you can just leave the video. Oh, got it. Hater. Okay. Are you a hater? Well, see you. I'm just gonna leave this this video. I see the light. Oh, it's just the lamp, the light over there. Okay, well, see you. See you tomorrow, Stephen. Okay. Good night. Good night. Double whammy.